I'm Adam Riley. This is The Scrum, and today we're going to talk about the politics of St. Patrick's Day. With me is Peter Kadzis of WGBH News. Peter, uh, St. Patrick's Day is fast approaching, and there's some interesting political footnotes this year. Bill Linehan, the city councilor who would hope to host the, uh, some would say, fabled St. Patrick's <laughs> Day breakfast, is getting out of town, going to Limerick in Ireland instead. Meanwhile, new Mayor Marty Walsh says he won't march in the St. Patrick's Day parade in South Boston if gay and lesbian groups are not allowed in the parade. What do you make of these two developments? What they show is that St. Patrick's Day ain't what it used to be, and it hasn't been for some time. I mean, um, ex-mayor Tom Menino really cut the knees out from under the holiday by refusing, quite rightly, to march in the parade. It, it, it's um, the, the event is tired. Um, also, Bill Linehan is city council president. Right. Um, he's going to Ireland, and I think uh, it, it can be looked at two ways. One, he's A, either a sorehead because he tried unsuccessfully to upstage new state senator Linda Dacina Forey. Who is Haitian American and yes. hosting the St. Patrick's Day. So he, but best for him is he avoids the whole issue, um, and, and he's probably hoping that gay and lesbian uh, marches will be allowed next year. By the way, Lenihan is not himself anti-gay, anti-lesbian, but he can't bite the bullet. Yeah, you know yeah. he he has to still be the homer. You know the the the, the hometown Good boy in this. Guy. So yeah, let me put you on the spot and ask for a prediction. How many more years does the St. Patrick's Day breakfast continue? Oh, I'd say. Uh, 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 five, six, seven. All right, interesting. We will hold you to that, revisit okay. the issue in, in that time. <laughs> well, Peter Kadzis, when the St. Patrick's Day breakfast is dead and buried and forgotten, we will come back and talk about it with you. <laughs> Thanks, as always, for being here. Thank you for watching The Scrum. I'm Adam Riley. We'll see you again soon. Great.